good morning and welcome back to my channel today I want to definitely go through my closet and just do a final clear out because I know there's a lot of stuff in here that I just don't wear anymore or that I just don't want anymore um, I feel like it's weird when other people get older I feel like I make personal decisions in my life but now that you know my husband turned 50 and and now I'm in my 50s I just kind of feel like I need to my wardrobe needs to transition and I feel like I have a lot of useful things and and I'll show you as we go through what I'm talking about so that's what's happening today so if you're interested just keep watching Hi, and welcome to my channel. I hope that you will consider subscribing. My channel consists of fashion and beauty, artistic and non-artistic Bible studies, clothing hauls, as well as beauty tips and tutorials, and just some plain old-fashioned fun. Thank you for watching, and I hope you'll consider subscribing. Okay, so... I want to start out by clearing out a lot of this stuff and the main thing that I want to probably take out is a lot of these shorts and a lot of these little rompers like that that I don't know I just don't feel like I want to have in my wardrobe anymore these shorts and just I've done a clear out in here before but I just feel like I need to go back through. I have a lot of stuff hanging here that I don't have room for in here. And I just know there's a lot of stuff I'm not going to wear. And so I just need to kind of get rid of a lot of this stuff and move it out of here so that I can have more room. When we went to Colorado, I did a lot of shopping. And I don't know if I will post that haul before this video but I bought a lot of clothes that I want to bring in here and again like I said this stuff here has just been hanging there because I don't have room but I have a lot of stuff that I can just clear out of here that if I haven't worn in the past couple of years I'm not gonna wear it I don't know why I keep holding on to it so I'm gonna kind of speed through this process so that um, this video doesn't get really really long Okay, so here is all the clothes that I've taken down. Now, I haven't gone through my pants yet because my pants I have a little bit harder issue with deciphering through. But as you can see, I have a whole lot more room here. I have a whole lot more room there and here. And as I mentioned, I want to put this stuff in here I just haven't been able to do that because of all this other stuff now I don't know if I'll put some of this on Poshmart or not I haven't really done Poshmart in a while and my last clean out I just donated the clothes and I might just decide to do the same thing I can tell you right now that's not something I'm gonna do right now all of this will probably just go into the garage and so usually my long sleeve sweaters and my longer skirts and longer dresses in my other closet and what I'm thinking also is I might fold a lot of these shirts and put them in my drawers but um, I don't have a lot of my I have some long sleeves here but the majority I have in that other closet that I definitely am going to go through as well to just try to get that minimized so that I can have more room 
for other clothes. So what I decided to do is like any of my shirts that have to do with the NFL, I'm going to fold and put in my drawer. So any, I have this one and I have this one with my uh, college, I have the New York Yankees, I have the Cowboys, and so all of these shirts I'm, I don't reach for always, so I think these will be good to put in the drawer. And then all of my Victoria's Secret pink shirts, oops, I think I left a Cowboys shirt in here and a Red Raider shirt. Okay, yeah, I had this cowboy shirt and that Texas Tech Red Raider shirt in there. And then these little pink shirts, I think I'm just going to go ahead and put in my closet for my nightwear. Because usually that's where I have these so that I can wear them at night when or after work. I usually come into this area to get something to wear just to lounge around so I think this will be a good place for this so that they're all together now this is the other closet that I want to go through only because I don't know that I want everything in here as far as like clothes I've had this stuff for a long time I keep holding on to these long sleeve shirts thinking I'm gonna wear them and I haven't and so I'm gonna do a quick clear through of this closet as well I have a lot of my winter stuff in here my longer dress thicker dresses so I am going to also go through this closet very quickly and just pull some stuff out okay so here's all this stuff and then all of that on the floor and you know, I just, a lot of this stuff I hardly wore or, you know, I just never wore at all. So, you know, it's hard to get rid of stuff that you, like this dress, this buffalo dress. It's brand new and I just have never worn it because the scoop goes down too low. And I'm not comfortable with that. I haven't thought about wearing it with a turtleneck, but I could. Or some climate wear underneath, and it'd probably look fine. And now that I said that, I might keep that one. But all the rest of these, I just, I don't wear, and I don't need in here. Now, it doesn't look like I made much progress in here. Still looks very full. But, I just, a lot of this stuff... I'll see if I wear during the winter time and if I don't then I'll be done with it and if I do then it'll stay but I definitely don't need to buy more stuff for winter and so I went ahead and took a lot of these dresses that were in that other closet and put them here now that I have more room and I feel like they should go here like I feel like there's a lot of them that should go here and the way I like to position these is by by the length of the sleeve and so I like to that's the way I like to put them but starting from here this bell sleeve and on these were in that other closet and so I've brought them over here I'm still going to go through these pants just not right now because the way I like to do the pants portion is, the way I like to look through my pants is to actually try them on. And I'm just not in a trying on mood right now. <laughs> I just went through all this clothes. So I'm just going to put all of this in the garage. I'm going to fold those shirts and put them in the drawer. And then I'm going to eat breakfast because I haven't had breakfast yet. And I think I might just incorporate all of this stuff into this closet and then call it a day because... Moving clothes around, it can be exhausting and also trying clothes on. So I will show you where all of this is once I get it all done. Okay, so I've put all that clothes in here in the garage. 
And what I'll do later is I'll also go through and take all the hangers off and just put them on this little rack that I have here with all the hangers, which helps me when I, sorry, <laughs> when I'm clearing stuff out and putting stuff back in, it's real helpful to me to have the hangers in. I do try to be a little cohesive with my hangers, but sometimes that just doesn't come together, especially when I'm putting clothes in and taking clothes out daily. So I'm really hoping that taking all of that clothes out of here will help me bring some order to this closet. And that way I don't have it in here and I don't have to worry about space for things that I'm not even wearing anymore, things I don't want to wear anymore. And so I think it's good to do the out of sight, out of mind type of thing. So that's why I put everything in the garage. And hopefully I won't bring any of that stuff back in because I have a bad habit of doing that. Like I'll clear things out. Like that buffalo sweater dress. I just decided to say no because it does come down too low. And I know I'm not going to like it and I haven't worn it. So I'm just, I'm, I have to just say I'm not going to wear it and either... Put it on Poshmark or give it away or do something else besides letting it take up room in here. Okay, so I have folded these and I'm putting them in my drawer now. And I really feel like that'll help me to have the space that I need. And also be able to find these when I want to find them. So I've always had these shirts in here. And to be honest with you, I forget about them because they are in a drawer. But I think I forget about them when they're hanging as well. So that left me at least a little bit more room here. I left some of the shirts that I definitely wear to work. So uh, on casual Friday. So I've left those. Okay. So I've cleared that out for the most part. I have left some coats and a suit that I'll be putting in my other closet. I just leave these here because honestly, when I bought these from Topshop, they didn't fit the way I wanted them to. And so I've just kind of left them out as I journey on with my wantingness and willingness to adjust my eating. I want to see progress by trying on these pants and so I want to leave them out. The other blazers um, I wear all the time so I've left those there. But I've incorporated the other clothes into my closet. I still have room over there. Now I will be incorporating more of the stuff that I purchased when we were in Colorado. But at this point I haven't hauled any of that stuff or tried it on. So I don't want to put it in here in this video only because, like I said, I haven't tried it on and um, I'm not sure if I'm keeping everything. It's based on the try-on. So that will be my next video and then I'll start incorporating that stuff in here. But I feel like I've made great progress in here by clearing a lot of that stuff out and hopefully I can maintain this and and if I'm not going to wear something, just get rid of it because it's just taking up space. So anyway, thank you for watching and please like and subscribe to my channel. Bye!